Hello everyone and welcome to my Bachelor official YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. As criticism of The Bachelor's Kelsey Anderson's relationship with Joey Graziade grows, she attacked a TikTok user. During season 28 of The Bachelor, where Joey proposed to Kelsey after sending over two dozen women home and seeing three competitors give up on their quest for love on television, Joey and Kelsey first met and fell in love. They have been flaunting their romance on social media with adorable pictures and videos ever since The Bachelor concluded. Regretfully, Kelsey and Joey have had to deal with mounting criticism and concerns about their ability to stay together in recent weeks. Kelsey took aim at one of her detractors head-on in a recent TikTok video. The winner of The Bachelor recorded herself driving and posted a critical remark for everyone to see. In response, Dardar61 stated quite frankly, You're completely insane. Kelsey said, The crude remarks are always the best from older people, like this one, acknowledging that the TikTok user had come for her. What? Kelsey scrunched up her face after reading the comment. With a mocking undertone, she went on to say that she thought the comment was original. Last but not least, Kelsey shared a screenshot of the meaning of the term whacked from vocabulary, which reads, exhausted or worn out. Whether the TikTok user intended to say whacked or whacked is unclear because Kelsey's vocabulary screenshot had the words spelled differently. However, Dardar61 attempted to justify the original comment by claiming, that's what I meant, I thought she was going nuts, as user 7,295,997,110,936 agreed with the word's definition and stated they were similarly tired and worn out. What this person meant when they said they felt Kelsey was crazy is unclear. Whack has another meaning according to Urban Dictionary which is something that really sucks. Even though Kelsey exposed this specific hater for all of her followers to see, she took sure to reply in a humorous and lighthearted manner that highlighted her quirky side. It's preferable for reality TV celebrities to react to offensive remarks by making the situation amusing. Nonetheless, it's probably not a good idea to pay too key to internet trolls. Amplifying negativity on social media is a risk because it gives some people the impression that they may keep hurting others because a celebrity or TV personality will see them. At a time when there is greater scrutiny than ever before on Kelsey's relationship with Joey, she releases a new TikTok video. On social media and the internet, there is constant speculation about whether or not they are exhibiting signs of impending breakup. There are persistent rumors, including ones about claimed financial difficulties, that Joey and Kelsey have addressed. She and Joey should block the account or choose to ignore it entirely rather than calling out specific remarks that are bad, even if it's good to put an end to horrible rumors. The infidelity story about Natalie Joy may have been fabricated, despite reality personality Harry Jowsey's claims that she cheated on Nick Vile. Alternatively, the ex-bachelor and his new spouse can be attempting to fabricate events to justify the gossip. For up-to-date information on the suspected cheating scandal, continue reading. Allegedly, Natalie Joy cheated on Nick Vile. Nick Vile tried to find love in the Bachelor franchise for years of his adult life. However, he ultimately met his future bride via direct messages on social media. In April, two months after the couple's first child was born, he wed Natalie Joy. Recently, there have been rumors circulating on social media that Natalie cheated on Nick when they were engaged. It was purported that one of her ex-friends verified the rumors on social media. The claims, however, remained limited to a small portion of the internet until Harry Jowsey, star of Too Hot to Handle, blasted Nick Vile's wife for the alleged adultery in response to Nick Vile condemning his romantic involvement. 
Although Nick Vile and Natalie Joy have not responded to the accusations directly, a recent post on his social media seems to refute them. The couple explains the timeline of their relationship. One of the most popular podcasts is hosted by Nick Vile. Among the many notable guests on The Vile Files is inmate Gypsy Rose Blanchard, who was interviewed for the show for the first time. The former bachelor frequently discusses relationship problems on his podcast and provides insights about his romance with Natalie Joy. He shared a little snippet from a recent podcast in which he and Natalie argue over how their relationship changed from being a casual date to an exclusive one. Natalie Joy claims that her current spouse never formally asked her to be his girlfriend. He disagreed and related an anecdote about asking her over the phone when she was out of town to be exclusive. Fans don't think it's real. Many comments on the TikTok post suggested that Nick and Natalie were attempting to alter the course of their relationship in order to refute the claims of infidelity. If they weren't exclusive, then it wouldn't be considered cheating, would it? Here are a few responses criticizing the pair for their discussion on the podcast. Right now, the PR maneuver genuinely makes me laugh. Evidently, she continued to see other people. Organizing the mess I observe. This post could not have come at a better time. Could your ploy be any more obvious? Hold on. About this, Nick narrated a whole different narrative. Your tail shifts significantly. I recall an episode where Nick was cautious to pursue a relationship with Natalie since she took the initiative, would come stay over, and told you she wanted to be more than just a hookup. For years, the entire narrative around you has been that Natalie threatened to stop seeing you if you didn't commit, so you finally asked her to be exclusive. What is this story about? Do you believe that Nick Vile and Natalie Joy were attempting to deflect attention from the cheating claims, or were they just sharing a genuine portion of their relationship story? Post your ideas in the comment section. Natalie Joy accused of cheating on Nick Vile. Nick Vile spent years of his adult life trying to find love in the Bachelor franchise, but he ended up meeting his future wife through social media DMs. He married Natalie Joy in April, two months after the couple welcomed their first child. Rumors swirled on social media recently that Natalie once cheated on Nick during their engagement. One of her former friends allegedly confirmed the speculation on social media. However, the rumors were contained to a small section of the internet until Too Hot to Handle star Harry Jowsey hit back at Nick Vile, criticizing his romantic entanglements by blasting Nick's wife for the alleged infidelity. Neither Nick Vile or Natalie Joy have directly addressed the accusations, but a recent post on his social media seemed to shut down the allegations. The couple clarify their relationship timeline. Nick Vile hosts one of the most popular podcasts. The Vile Files has a stellar guest list that has included one of the first interviews with convict Gypsy Rose Blanchard. The former bachelor uses his podcast to discuss relationship issues and often shares details of his romance with Natalie Joy. He posted a short clip from one recent podcast where he and Natalie discuss and disagree over how their relationship transitioned from just dating to being an exclusive couple. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.